Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to get started with the action bar in your Android app. Basically if you want it to look like this, this is what you're going to need to do. Out of the box, if you're running the SDK version 15 like I am, it should come up just like this. This is what you want to see, just this action bar. I can show you some images of what action bars look like in different apps, but this is probably something to what yours will look like. Well, action bars can display strings, they can say stuff like the name of the app, the name of the activity, it also has the icon of the app, stuff like that. Uh, you can add buttons over here um, So you could add the little three dot menu that has settings under it or you can add a whole bunch of different stuff Like let's say it was a Messaging app you could click a send new message button that would be right here or something like that as I said before I'm using SDK version 15 comes right up just like this. Let's say you want to support older versions of Android if you want to support 11 version 11 and up you need to go down here to Gradle scripts, open this up. You'll see build.gradle and build.gradle. Click the second one, double click it, and you'll see down here it says min SDK version. Uh, basically, you want to set that to version 11. That will now support any version between 11 and current. Seeing as there is hardly anybody using that low of a version, there isn't really a point in using that. So I'm going to keep mine at 15. That's where I'd recommend it. That's where Google recommends it. I would keep it there. But just in case you're wondering, that's how you can do that. There will be more about how to use the action bar and add more stuff to it in the next video.